everybody, Johnny Jans here, and welcome to Universal Studios on day number 90 of this thing that I'm doing. Standing behind me is the Universal Studios globe, which is essentially a giant fountain. And that's what I'm gonna go do. I saw the fountains over Islands of Adventure, but today I wanna go in Universal Studios and find fountains and water features that are around the park. So, prepare to get wet as we head inside and go do so. Hand ring around. And behold the Universal Studios globe slash fountain slash water feature. This is the most popular place to take a picture. It's usually a horde of people. And I love the fog coming off the fountain at the bottom. What a fun water feature fountain this is. And it's right as you enter the park. So my hopes are a little high to find some other fun water features at Universal Studios today. My God might be providing some water features of his own because it's starting to rain a little bit. Will it get up, turn up a little more? I don't know, we'll find out. But I'm gonna count that as a water feature in the park today because sometimes it rains. Look at this, I'm not even inside the park yet and I have another fountain that's right over here in front of the guest service ticket area. And look at this fun fountain. It's very green and rustic and very classy. I like it. And even though it's all scratched out, they still give all the proceeds of the money to the Give Kids the World Village. So, thumbs up. Check it out up here at Cafe La Bamba. I got another water feature for you. It's a fountain and it looks like it has some kind of art in the center of it. Oh, is that a wood stork? We have a lot of those in Florida. Maybe that's what that is, some kind of crane, crane creature. But I love it. Hidden water features. Got another water fountain for you. Just on the side of Cafe La Bamba is a, this wonderful flowing water fountain. Look at this. That's beautiful. This place is already rocking water features and fountains and I'm not even through the park yet. This is gonna be a good day. So when you see a fountain, do you ever get the urge to just go full on friends and want to jump in the fountain? Because I think about that, the opening to Friends, about every time I see a fountain. I'll be like, I want to jump in there and dance to the Rembrandts. And right now, to take E.T. home, it's only a 10 minute wait. All right. Looks like E.T.'s ready to go. Look at this, inside E.T. there's a water feature. It's water trickling off some rocks. It's so cool. Not that I'm advocating it or anything, but if you were to get rid of E.T., I could think of a retheme that would work without much change. Could you imagine this as a Stranger Things attraction? And I feel like Stranger Things would provide less change throughout the ride because it's already 80s themes as it is. It's already woods and the E.T.'s planet could be relative to the upside down. Just something to think about, but I still love E.T. and I'll always enjoy the fact that he'll be right here. And of course, the greatest water feature here at Universal Studios we have to talk about is the Universal Lagoon as it's centered in the middle of the park and often hosts the nighttime shows. Over here in London, just outside the Wizarding World, we have an epic fountain indeed. Look at the sculptures from the bottom to the top. There's like angels and fish, water all around, and it's situated right in front of the night bus. So that's pretty cool. All right, walking into Diagon Alley on the Wizarding World on the studio's end. And look, we got a fountain water feature right here that you can turn on with magic if you're so magically inclined. I'm gonna wand it up a little bit. I'm gonna stand on this and it, look, it gives you how to do the spell. And look, I just like that, it, it did it. I'm amazing. Wow. I. No, I didn't, I missed it, almost splashed me. Let's see, can I do it again? Ha <laughs> ha! I don't know, I probably can't do it again. Located right in front of Fast and the Furious Supercharge is a very Los Angeles looking fountain indeed. Check out the angels. And do you remember the one Fast and the Furious where Dom jumped his charger over the fountain? <laughs> 
Give it time. It'll probably happen soon. There it is, folks. So look at all the different water features that are here at Universal Studios. I was surprised just how many I could actually find. But that's gonna do it for me today. Until next time, probably here at Universal, I'm Johnny Jans, and as always, I'll catch you out there. Hand ring around. She, uh, she's a wizard, there you go. Good job. The magic is strong in you.